hello students i hope all of you are doing good and not wasting your time i think most of the students are facing problem during this lockdown so i have decided to teach mathematics of standard 10 i hope all will like it and support me thank you okay let us start chapter number 4 quadratic equations a quadratic equations in the variable x is an equation of the form ax square plus bx plus c equal to 0 where a b c are real numbers and a should not be equal to 0 why a should not be equal to 0 because in quadratic equation the degree is 2 and if you put 0 over here you will get a linear equation like this that means suppose let us take one example 3x square plus twice x plus 1 equal to 0 in place of a i have written 3 b equal to 2 and c equal to 1 now this is a quadratic equation but if i put this one in place of a if i put 0 if i put this one as 0 you will get this type of equation and such type of equation are known as linear equation what linear what type of equation linear equation where the power is 1 degree is 1 okay now let us proceed to exercise 4.1 it is given in the exercise number 1 that check whether the following are quadratic equation number 1 it is given x plus 1 whole square equal to 2 into x minus 3 so what we will do we will simplify it and we will find out whether it is a quadratic equation or not now expand this to a plus b whole square formula it will be a square plus b square plus twice a b isn't it that means x square plus 1 plus twice x and this side twice x minus 6 twice x twice x cancel and you will get x square plus 1 and this one minus 6 will come to the left hand side and it will be 6 which is equal to 0 that means you have to write yes it is of the form it is of the form quadratic equation similarly we can do this one so what we will do expand it x square minus twice x equal to this one minus 2 into 3 which is minus 6 minus 2 into minus x which is plus twice x now bring this minus 6 and plus twice x to the left hand side what it will be x square minus twice x this one minus 6 will be plus 6 and minus twice x equal to 0 isn't it that means you will get x square minus 4x plus 6 equal to 0 now it is of the form ax square plus bx plus c you can compare it with the standard form of quadratic equation this is the standard form of quadratic equation which is ax square plus bx plus c equal to 0 similarly you can do the third one which is just expand it it will be x square x into x x square x into 1 which is x then minus twice x then minus 2 on the right hand side it will be x into x x square then x into this plus twice x then this into this minus x this one will be minus 3 so now you can see x square x square will get cancelled and then this one x minus twice x you will get minus x minus 2 and on the right hand side you will get twice x minus 3 bring this on the left hand side minus x minus 2 
minus y6 plus 3 equal to 0. As you can see, it is not of the form of quadratic equation. Solve it minus y6 minus 2 plus 3 equal to 0. So it is not of the form of quadratic equation. So in this way you have to do number 1. Number 1.